Rob Waffles had given up. Rob Waffles, formerly popular by pity, now forgotten. Now alone. But then, one day, he saw it. Do you remember me, Rob? Rob Waffles? Remember, we went to school together. No? Oh, but I bet you remember Bob. Oh, they all remember Bob. I was so boring. He was so cool. He stole the spotlight. He stole the girl. He stole my life. But now, I'm going to take it back. When I'm done with him, no one will even remember silly little Bob Pancakes. And hello, I'm Plum Bob's in the past, and today I bring you Rob versus Bob, a slightly unhinged Sims 4 mini challenge. Now, in this challenge, we have several goals. One, Rob has to have the outgoing trait, which he has. Two, he has to move to Willow Creek. Three, he has to get a job in the culinary career and work his way up to the mixology branch. Now, I personally find this career very boring, so I've added the challenge of him running a bar slash restaurant using the wonderful Carl's Dine Out Reloaded mod. We also have to get his mixology and cooking skills up to level four and his gaming up to level two, and he has to meet and befriend his former high school classmates. In addition, the truly unhinged part is that what we need to do is get Eliza to fall in love with Rob, they have to become soulmates, and she has to divorce Bob, then we have to have two children with Eliza move into their home and redecorate Bob's room, in whatever order we choose to do. In addition, we also have to throw a high school reunion at some point in all of this, but that's kind of up to us whenever we want to do it. Now, I've made Rob a pretty challenging sim to work with. He's got the self-absorbed and high maintenance traits, and I gave him the villainous Valentine aspiration because I kind of felt like that suited who he is as a human being. In addition, I feel like he's kind of an insomniac, um, so he's got the seldom sleepy reward trait. And he currently has got a girlfriend... Her name is Sophia, and she happens to be an alien. It just kind of happened. Hey! So this is his cousin, which, while I was filming the montage, I had Rob research his genealogy, and the game generated, well, kind of randomly generated a cousin for him. I didn't know that that could happen, but I'm telling you, this guy, Daniel, he looks like rob's twin it's very weird <laughs> he even came with the same hair so the game randomly generated after i researched genealogy a cousin so i guess he's his cousin he came and stayed with him for a little bit so rob let's go ahead and get you up and um we don't have very many skills uh for the challenge like he had to cook one time which is why his skill is at level 17 percent but we don't have mixology and we don't have any video gaming because i felt like that would be cheating so 
We're gonna go ahead and have a fruit salad for breakfast, if you don't mind, Rob. And we're gonna go ahead and get started with building at least these skills today. Once he's gone ahead and made himself some breakfast, we'll go ahead and get a job in the mixology or the culinary career. He's thinking about being an astronaut. Sorry, Rob, not today. Today, we are going into the culinary career. Mm-hmm. Ah, oh, Rob, sitting here and plotting. Plotting your imminent takeover of Bob Pancakes. Like, whoa, you finished that in two bites? Good for you, pal. Good for you. He wants to get things done, you know? He's thinking about food. You're right. Let's go ahead and work on making some... Ew, gross. Go ahead and clean that up for us, and then we will make a couple of drinks. Just for our work task just to get ahead of it. And we might go and say hi to some of our old classmates. Go around, introduce ourselves to them. I'm sorry, girlfriend, not just now. Okay, so one of Rob and Bob's former high school classmates were Mortimer and Bella Ga. So we're gonna go ahead and get started working on Mortimer and see if we can go ahead and get him to be our pal. We've got to become good friends with everyone except for Bob, according to the challenge rules. So we're just going to go ahead and, you know, try and convince them that we're a good pal. Seems like they're getting along so well. Look at that. I don't know. You can kind of chick chat, chick chat away. Share some photos, you know, like fish for some compliments if you want to. That's your personality. You can fire him up. Flatter him, maybe? Maybe deep conversation as well. Cassandra thinks that he's funny. Oh, and Rob thinks that Mortimer is wonderful, and he just wants the best for him. They're going to be besties in no time. Let's talk about our dreams. I'd really like to get to know some of Mortimer's traits, maybe. And then I think we're going to invite him to our high school classmates club. Hello, Bella. Good to see you again. We went to high school together. You might not remember. I was a little bit of a loner. Oh my. That's one way to make a first impression. Um, let's just like, you know, get to know them, you know? We want to basically take over this town. We want to be the ones. Do we know anything about Mortimer yet? He's creative. Okay. Bella, do you have a career? Bella's good. Okay. Can hug her if you want to. Can tell a joke if you want to, you know. Flatter her, maybe. Huh, interesting. Didn't know that about her. And then, Bella, you remember how we were in high school together? Why don't you join the high school classmates club? Oh, we're moving. We're on the move. Yeah, you remember? It was so great. High school? I loved it. It wasn't traumatizing at all. I'm not here seeking out a uh, solution to a long-term vendetta. What are you... Oh, that was the flatter animation. Flatter and uh, something else, if you know what I mean. Oh my gosh, that cold look on Rob's face when she said yes, when he was like... <laughs> He's kind of terrifying, but you know, uh, not right now, cuz. Right now, we're working on becoming good friends with everyone. Yeah, what you said, Bella, what you said. He doesn't seem to get along with her. He has a lot of, like, negative things pop up as his first thing. Uh, let's just, like, really lean in here. Fish for compliments, maybe. Oh, looks like Rob is becoming the center of attention like he's always wanted. We're gonna go ahead and just go cloud gaze with our good pal Mortimer. Build up this relationship just a little bit more. 
maybe at nine we'll go ahead and head to the restaurant and we'll see if we can open it and make some money there. So here is the former dump that was uh, from the little montage, but now it is an arcade bar. Of course, we've got the bar over there, the entertainment activities over here, and then just kind of a small like to-go kitchen in here. Nothing crazy and nothing wild, just a nice little place to call Rob's, you know? See if we can make some money. Look at us go. We're in here cooking up a storm with our fancy hipster outfit. These two over here are having the best time. Five stars just for having fun. And I haven't actually run this yet, so we don't have anything. We're starting from nothing except for the little bit of money we put in here. It's not exactly a poppin' location, but... Well, that's our club. But we have made $300 profit today. Oh, and they want some drinks. Nice. Sugar cane juice, how interesting. So, ladies, what brings you to my cool arcade bar, hmm? Having a good time, sugar cane juice? Oh, and we just got to Mixology level 2. Great job, my dude. Can you go and uh, check on this table? You know? See what's what. It is tough running a whole place all by yourself, but... Once we get our cooking skill up to level 4, we might go ahead and order... or order. Yeah, we might go ahead and order another chef to come and take care of the chef cooking, even though we don't get that many customers. We might go ahead and invest in getting some advertisement. Whoa, that guy didn't look okay. Is he still running around? Probably not what you want to see in the middle of the night. Oh, dang. Very strange. It's 2.30 in the morning. We're still not tired. And we have work in seven hours. And we've... Whoa. Made 5.86 today. 6.42. Dang. That was a pricey drink, my friend. I'm gonna disallow new customers and let these guys play out. Maybe we'll actually... Maybe we'll actually improve ourselves. Um, do you guys need anything else or are you done? Take order again. Man, these two are really hungry. I mean, I'll keep taking your order as long as you want to have more food. Thanks for coming in, Mr. Harjo. Just waiting for these two to decide they've had enough. They want to go home. Been here for about six hours, you know, eating all the courses, which, you know, good for them. They're having a full meal, but we've got other things to do. So, yeah, there we go. Catch you later, my dudes. Thanks for dropping by. <laughs> so sad. Such a sad guy. But we are at mixology level two and a half, basically cooking level one and a bit. No video gaming yet. So we're about halfway there on the skills. And we've got two out of the five sims we have to become good friends with already as our friends. So I think we're well on our way and it's just day one. Now that we've cooked for other people, we're going to cook for ourselves and look very suspicious while we're doing it. <laughs> Guess. Does it look like apples, Rob? Does it look like apples? Does it smell like apples, Rob? Oh, Sophia must be here. Talking to us. Why are you flipping out? Oh, buddy. Why don't you invite her to join cooking and then ask her about her day since you've wanted to do that for a while? 
pretty sure that's what he wants. Here's Sophia, Sophia Crenshaw, randomly generated by the game, currently dazed thanks to the juiced neighborhood help? action plan. We might have to get rid of that. Maybe it'll help, but maybe not. Isn't she so pretty? She was randomly generated. So pretty. Also, so alien. So alien. That doesn't look very good. This is buttered popcorn. Look at it. Ew. Ew. Something's gone wrong. Hmm. Are you happier now? Hangnail. Rough. Why don't you, you know, flirt with her? She is your lady. You can flirt with her. Shabini Maybe you can embrace her. Ah. No, maybe you can just, you know, have a nice time before you go to work. Work to slay. Need. What? She said no. In fairness, we are going to definitely be cheating on you. What? We don't have a water conservation action plan. Okay, Rob. Good luck at work. We're going to work hard because we're no slacker and we've got a life to take over. So go ahead and work hard, crush the competition, and get promoted. A promotion. That's right. Clean up the spoiled food. Take a shower, and we might go ahead and, um, maybe we will go for a jog. A no-sweat run, maybe. Now, what do we have to do? Prepare food or mix drinks on it, like a car bonnet, my dude. We want to go meet someone? Okay. You've convinced me, Rob. I was going to have us go for a little workout, but instead, let's go and meet... The land grabs, who are the next on our list of sims that we need to befriend. Yeah, Brittany Cho is really good at this. Or not. Let's go ahead and knock on that door. We've got some people to meet, Rob. Rob and your slick and also... You know, it's a choice, the whole turtleneck and loafers thing. It's not really for me, but it's a choice. Why don't you go say howdy to Nancy? Why, hello, Nancy. This is also an updated version of the land grabs from the gallery. I thought they looked pretty cool. Uh, why don't you ask about her day? Like, we're trying to become her friend, you know? Show off her muscles, maybe? Fire up. Oh, 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 she was impressed by that. Listen, we're Rob Waffles and we are pretty impressive. Like, if you didn't know, like, it's true. We're an impressive person and everyone was all about Bob, you know? Everyone was about Bob. If you don't remember from high school, like, you all were like, oh, Bob, Bob. But, you know, Rob is pretty cool and Rob is me and uh, I'm telling you about how cool I am. So let's be besties. What do you think? I like your nails. Yeah, Nancy, get on the Rob train, you know? We can be besties. Oh, what's your degree? I didn't know you had one. Oh. Oh. Let's get to know you. Who are you? Tell us your secrets. We used to be Snoopy, but we gave up that trait, so... Economics. How interesting. Mm. Oh, materialistic, eh? 
Athenica Tablo. Nancy, <laughs> do you want to be part of our high school Lisa classmates Lisa. club? What do you reckon? Also play chess with you if you want to. Like, I'll do it. What is this build? Well, whatever. Is Jeffrey around? Doesn't seem like it. Where's he gone off to? Where is he? Why is he not here with you? Why don't you play with Nancy? Malcolm is here. Where's your dad? Jeffrey? You're out pretty late, pal. <gasps> Social bunny. That's right. Let us... Let's add our high school. Okay, Sophia, you can be on there since you're our girlfriend for now. <laughs> Cousin, you can be one of our contacts. Bella, you're in. Morty, you're in. Nancy, you're in. Let's go ahead and send like a nice friendly message to everyone. Make sure we're keeping our socials up. Now I know that we could uh, spam them and then we become best friends forever. But I reckon one or two messages a day is pretty good. Working 11 hours. We've got to do some mixology stuff. Well, soon. Oh, we're feeling flirty. And we're flirting. Listen, Nancy, you're looking really good. Where's Jeffrey? Oh, here he is, just hanging out outside of his own home. Oh my goodness, this Jeffrey is so fancy. Look at him. Look at this Jeffrey. He's like, he's a real upgrade. Dang, dude. Dang. You guys probably should stop flirting. Your husband's come home. I don't know what your relationship is like, but, you know. Why don't you give her some fake bad news? You know, just so that we... We don't get caught. We don't want him to become suspicious of us. Because we have to become friends with him soon. Oh. Oh my. I don't know what she said to him, but he did not like it. Show off your muscles. Maybe propose a crazy scheme. I didn't know that he was going to be uh, drinking his water in the bathtub, old Jeffrey. So we'll go ahead and try and sneak another little flirt in there. Cake? Just kidding. I was joking. Playing a dangerous game here with Nancy. We still have to become friends with Jeffrey as well, so... Well, she's flirting with us autonomously. Thanks, Nancy. We've really been working out lately. We uh, wanted to make sure that we overpowered Bob and everything. I think Nancy's got some feelings towards us. I think Nancy wants... Yeah, we can be friends with emotional decision makers like Nancy. Looks like Jeffrey's coming back through. Will you go ahead and call it a day. Let's call it a day. Actually, let's go and say hi to Jeffrey. Um, let's not do flirty with him yet. Because don't forget, Rob really wants to be a villainous Valentine. He's got to get caught cheating 10 times. Got to become X status several times. Got to break up some couples. This Jeffrey is so cool. Oh, we're just going to chat with him for a bit. Sort of get ready for the next work day. And then catch up when it's time to go back to work. <gasps> oh, Bella just became good friends with Rob. Rob's angry. It's the worst day ever. But he's going to go meditate for a bit. And then later we might invite us him over. We've got some friends to... Wow, we are really good friends with Bella. Just like besties, you know? We've got things to do, Rob. Rob, we've got evil plans to accomplish. We haven't met Eliza yet, but that's okay. We've got other stuff we're doing. Other lives we're ruining. 
We're preparing. We're practicing. Getting in the zone. You can do this, Rob. You can crush the souls of your enemies. I'm pretty sure there is no water conservation action plan, but, you know, whatever. We'll call it our being a bad person tax. A hundred simoleons a day. Good luck at work. I don't want you to feel pressured, but we do need to get up quite a few different levels, so... Good luck, my friend. Working hard. What is this for? Creative skills? Okay. We didn't even get promoted? Dang. Okay, can you please go repair and repair that? Because everything's kind of a wreck, you know? Creative skills. Does that include... Oh, this isn't helping. Um, what kind of creative skills? You know what I think is a creative skill? Mixology. Rob's frustrated, I think, that he hasn't progressed more. He's like, yeah, my skills are good. Oh, when did you get video gaming? Don't know. He's like, my skills are going pretty well. I'm most of the way there for cooking and for mixology, but not promoted. I haven't done any of my aspiration. It's okay. Let's go ahead and message our pals. Daniel, Nancy, Jeffrey, old Morty, our girlfriend. Bella, did I already message you? Let's send a flirty towards Nancy as well, because we're just that kind of bad guy. Well, why don't you come and um, make your favorite drink? Because we have to do that for work anyways. Maybe that will help your mental fog. Oh, hey, Lilith. Didn't. It didn't. Okay, then go for a jog, my dude. Oh, I don't think you need to drink. What are you drinking? Apple nectar. That's your favorite. Didn't know that about you, Rob. Didn't know that about you. What a sophisticated, classy guy you are, huh? That seemed to have helped. Fog went down. Oh, good. This is gonna help. Okay. You go, pal. We believe in you. We were gonna invite people over, but I guess not. Uh-oh, Rob. I don't think we're gonna get to go to work today. Mm-mm-mm. Actually, maybe we will if we can run it off. We can go do a quick no-sweat run. If not, we're gonna have to not go to work today, because we're not going to burn out. We have too many dreams of world domination, Rob! We can't burn out. We have things to do. People to meet. Hearts to break. But I don't know that he actually really cares about any of these people. He thinks all of them are basic looking. I think Rob is really struggling. I don't think... I don't think this is really about what Rob thinks it's about, you know? I really don't. He's stomping around like he's angry, but he's not even angry. He's flirty. Oh, tomorrow's a romantic holiday? Interesting. Can we run this off? Show me what we're working with, Rob. Show me what we're working with. You're a powerful guy. You're a happy guy. You're gonna get promoted today. If we end up going. <laughs> oh, look at that. Just one more spot. Exactly for our good friend that we haven't met again yet. Eliza. Yay, no burnout. Okay, go to work, buddy. Get us a promotion, please, Rob. Working hard. That's right. We're gonna get promoted. Why? Because we're Rob Waffles. Flirt with your co-workers. Hey, Jeffrey. Oh, I'm glad you had a good time with Vlad. He actually snuck into my house, broke in, and uh, drank my blood not that long ago. 
So I'm glad that you've had a better relationship with him than I did. Yes! Why don't you go ahead and make some dinner for... Make some coconut rice, maybe? Tomorrow at 3 p.m. to 11? Interesting. And then we're going to invite over a friend. We have lots of friends, but we're going to invite over some special friends. Going to invite over Nancy and Sophia. Why? Because we have to do the get caught cheating 10 times. Achieve X status. Break up some couples. We don't have to. Nancy is already here. Nancy is fishing. Did our girlfriend come? Yes. Hello, Sophia. So sorry that I'm shortly going to break your heart, but I'm just that kind of a person. A bad one. Why? Well, because I'm Rob Waffles. Why don't you talk to her? Why don't you kiss her hands and stuff? Okay, just kidding. Why don't you flatter her? Express your admiration, but really you're just fishing for compliments. You can gossip if you want to. Okay, poor angle. Just walking all over the place, pal. You can ask a risque question. Okay, you can like cerebral sims, Rob. You tell me who you are, you know. Squarble Tarbahe Farbina. Flazzle Pelka. Orbitak. Ah, Bayumi. That's not. Uh, Nancy, no, but you can come here. Um, the whole group can come here together. We can release the steam vent. And we can all grab a serving together. How about that? Mmm, delicioso. Call to meal. Everyone, let's get a serving. Nancy, where are you? Are you still fishing? Nancy, come on over here. You know, I feel kind of bad for what I'm about to do. But this isn't about me. This is about Rob. Why don't you uh, enthuse about some interests with good old Nance? You can compliment her appearance, you know, tell an engaging story, flatter. Sophia doesn't even seem to mind the flirting. Oh, maybe she does. But apparently that doesn't... Oh, that does count as getting caught cheating. Well, you could... Oh, she doesn't even want an apology. Well, cool. You can flirt with her. Well, Rob, you've got to apologize. He doesn't even want to apologize. He doesn't even care. Oh, Yikes. Our relationship is, like, way down. <laughs> well, Rob, you're in this on your own now. I'm gonna let you handle it. I love that this is how we're having these conversations. Rob's like, oh, so here's my thoughts on this. Let's talk through this wall. <laughs> I don't know. Are we good friends with Nancy yet? Yes. Oh, that's two of the five. Two of the five that we're now good friends with. Rob, why don't you... Uh, okay, you guys are feeling each other. You're just doing this autonomously, you know? Like, you do you, guys. You do you. Ah, uh, Sophia's not very happy. Sorry, Sophia. You're still our girlfriend, though. 
Also, we're planning to eventually break up Nancy and Joffrey. Jeffrey. Because we've got to break up ten couples, you know? The hardest part of that is going to be finding ten couples, me thinks. Ooh, lovers. <laughs> they didn't get any negative sentiments from that. <sighs> Whatever. Now you kiss her again. You know what? Why don't you two have a nice little time together? Are you two up here? Uh... Oh my, Nancy. What an outfit you're wearing. Well, you two do what you want to do, you know? Okay, I think that's about where we'll leave it for today. To recap, what we've accomplished so far is being outgoing, moving to Willow Creek, getting a job in the culinary career, achieving about half of the skills, and becoming good friends with two of the five former high school classmates. I guess we'll see how far Rob gets next time. Thanks everyone for watching, and see you in part two. Bye bye everyone.